to my final morning report chart analysis video with me, Richard Paramark, and Alistair Attic Marks on Wednesday, 15th of November. Looking at gold, um, which is beginning to gain a little bit of traction to the upside. Um, on the back of the safe haven flow that we've seen, uh, as sort of risk appetite has dropped away uh, in the last sort of day or so, um, and that sort of helped to leave a, a little couple of um, positive candles here. Uh, 17, uh, sorry, 1270. Uh, yesterday's low. Uh, the market's bounced from that 15 bucks um, and started to pull higher. Nothing yet decisive yet and um, you're still sort of stuck pretty much rangy but there is a sequence of little higher lows. You've got 1260 obviously, 63, that one, 65 and now 70 and all the while the market is sort of starting to sort of form these higher highs as well. So it's sort of ekes towards a, a move on uh, the resistance at 1290 um, but yeah nothing really decisive yet but the gold price has been supported by this sort of safe haven shift that we have seen so um, arguably on a very near term basis and I um, sort of stress this very near term you'd be looking to buy into weakness but you are still trading I think within this range so um, You'd look at using the um, momentum indicators, oscillators, to um, sort of uh, trigger your trades. I think the fact that you're up at 69 on the RSI again would suggest that's probably not the best timing. Um, so I'd be waiting for a little bit of a pullback, um, which you might be able to get um, that could pull you back towards sort of this near-term pivot. It's a very small one, around 1280. You might get five bucks out of it, but um, yeah, the market is um, sort of turning a little bit more dollar negative now, and um, certainly got the rally in gold is sort of reflective of this, and um, yeah, there's uh, possibly an opportunity. It's still not a great trade though. I don't think gold. Um, you're not getting too much traction out of it, and you get the intraday swings back as well, which could um, could prove problematic. So uh, I wish you good luck in your trading today, and I'll speak to you again tomorrow. Thank you.